Welcome to Midwest Outdoors. I'm Troy Tufto with my good friend Brad Hawthorne. We're up on Lake of the Woods out of Arneson's Rocky Point Resort. And Brad, I think the otters are going to get a workout today. We, they are. In fact, when we pulled out of the resort this morning, it was 25 below. So I'm going to be more than happy to jump in my otter and get fishing. And what we have here is we're in 25 feet of water, but about 100 yards behind us, 80 yards behind us, it comes up to about 16 feet. So what these fish are doing is they're going up there and they're looking for food up on the top of that reef. And then if they don't find food up there, they're just circling around and wandering around until they get to the bottom. For, they're just looking for that bait. So what we're seeing here today is we have a few, not a lot of suspended fish, and then a lot of fish on the bottom. But the ones that come in high, if you can get your lure to them fast enough and catch them before they scoot out of the area, you can usually catch those fish very, very aggressive. On Lake of the Woods, if you, here he comes. There we go. And that fish, it's a smaller fish, but was one of those that came right off that reef looking for, looking for bait. So that just goes to show you there, you can pull walleye. When people talk about suspended fish, a lot of times they're talking about them in the summertime, but in the wintertime, they will in fact suspend if the bait is suspending. And when you have a, a lake like Lake of the Woods, which has darker water, the fish aren't afraid to do that during the day and get out there and get that food in their stomach. I just love the way these fish fight. Oh, there we go. It's a big, big sauger there. You can come up here and you can get your limit of walleyes, but these saugers are absolute bonus fish. And if you look at the size of them, they are just perfect, perfect for the pan. And that one, I'll tell you what, that one's going in the bucket with. So today I'm fishing out of one of the new uh, extreme thermal hubs that Otter introduced this year. This is the XTH cabin. It's a six by six footprint. They also have a XTH lodge, which is an eight by eight footprint and so on up to the XTH Resort, which is a large six-sided house. Uh, if you get a chance to take a look at the Otter Hubs, you'll find that Otter incorporate a lot of the same quality that they put into their flipovers, that they're known for in their flipovers, into their hub-style shelters out this year. Oh. Nice little perch. See, and those are what I like. These are bonuses for the pail right there. That guy will flip. Real nice. You'll be catching walleye and sauger all day, and then one grabs a spoon and just takes off to the side, and you pull on him, you give him a little setback, and he's just going like this. You know, he's doing that almost like a sunfish thing. What we're catching all of our fish on are rattle spoons, and I started out this morning a larger profile bait, and now today, as the day's gone on, I've downsized, but I've added glow. Now, glow and then in the UV colors. This morning, the fish were a little bit more sluggish, so I was with that natural perch hue and we're just using a minnow head with those. But the one thing that has been key for the last few days out here is rattles. If you're not using a rattle spoon, you're just not catching fish. While Brad's fishing out of the uh, Pro Lodge, I want to take a moment to go through Otter's new Thermaltech fabric. Uh, it was developed specifically for ice fishing shelters, and it's unique in its layering system. The first thing you'll notice is the outside has minimal seaming on both the hub style shelter and the flip over style shelter. This is going to help eliminate wind penetration and light penetration into the interior of the shelter. So then when you look at the inside of the shelter material, you'll find that it's fully quilted and insulated, and that's gonna lock in that heat and virtually eliminate condensation. The best part is, is that Otter Thermaltech is available on all models of Otter shelters this season. Brad, what a great day on the ice. Absolutely. We piled up the fish, the otters performed as expected. For more information on Otter products, visit otteroutdoors.com. For Troy Tufto, I'm Brad Hawthorne, and you'll catch more on Midwest Outdoors coming up.